Harry's wife is Jane Doe, 170. Epstein's scheduler, Kellen, exposed Meg was massage girl for the rich. Prince Harry's fame-obsessed wife, Meghan Markle, is eager to brew up a revamped image after her bitter attacks on Britain's royal family permanently dented her reputation on both sides of the Atlantic, palace courtier's dish. Harry's honey playfully portrays a lowly intern in a new coffee commercial, but the effort was mocked by palace spies who claim the diva Duchess of Sussex's shot at salvaging her nasty girl rep was already destroyed by her. This is a desperate attempt to brand rehabilitation to make people forget the damage she's inflicted on Harry's family in her apparent revenge vendetta, a high-level courtier tells the National Enquirer. She seems to finally realise she's overplayed the victim card in her bid to chase her superstar dreams, and after falling flat on her face now needs to take a different route to success in 2024. In her latest rebranding exercise, Megan buzzes around as a worker bee in a clip for Clever Coffee, which counts the former suit star as an investor. However, the courtier sneers this ad appearance is strictly money-related and all about Meghan again. This is all to boost sales, even if it demeans her royal title. The palace aides' contempt for Meghan Markle is the same as theirs for Prince Andrew, both are unclean people within the royal family. It comes after a source on Blind Item revealed Meghan linked with Sarah Callan, who is a recruiter and scheduler for Epstein. The source wrote, How many degrees of separation are there between Meghan Markle and Sarah Callan? Fewer than you might think. No using anyone in the royal family to make the connection. Sarah Callum was Epstein's assistant and facilitator who scheduled the massages for the rich and powerful, all in the numerous court documents released. So the source is saying that Meg was directly connected to Epstein's scheduler since using royal connections would be one degree of separation. So is he more than implying Meghan was one of his girls, perhaps Jane Doe 170, who's appealing to not have a name released? For those who don't know, a federal judge in New York unsealed the identities of around 170 associates of Jeffrey Epstein last month. Jane Doe 170, whose name has been suppressed, is suspected to be Meghan Markle. So if this is true and Meghan is an Epstein associate, then there are tons of people who've seen her around him, been associated with her through Epstein and know her from both Yacht Life and Epstein Island. It means that anonymous leaks about her activities will slowly trickle out. It's time for her to get on Oprah's show and cry victim again, this time about Epstein. Weinstein and Epstein also had close connections and often worked together, where Weinstein would set aside small roles for models or actresses in exchange for favours. Weinstein's also known to have offered membership to Soho House to aspiring models and actresses, like a bait, in exchange for favours. Prince Harry's wife had relationships with both men. She clearly had many years of sucking up to dubious men in order to achieve a mediocre acting career, but the hard work paid off when least expected. Harry came along and she landed the biggest acting role of her life, 24-7, 365 days a year.